Today I'm going to show you how to make a cute aesthetic stationery in Canva. So if you want tutorials on Canva, Illustrator, or Photoshop, or if you want to learn how to sell your art online, uh, please subscribe to my channel and ring the notification bell so you're always updated whenever I upload new videos. So I have a 6x9 inch document. You can definitely choose any size of your preference. I just like 6x9 because this has been um, my most favorite when it comes to writing or taking notes. And I also use this to give to my friends. I'm starting off by selecting a square or a rectangle. I'm just placing it where I want it and resizing according to my liking. I'm going for a light pink aesthetic for this project, but of course any color will do. Now I'm making a copy of this rectangle and then making it a little lighter than the first shape. I'm also putting color on the outer part so that it's congruent with the whole theme of this project. Now under elements and lines and shapes, select the dotted line. Resize it until it fits the writing area. This part of Canva is where you can modify the weight of your lines and um, you can modify how thick or thin or how far apart your dots would be. You can just basically play with the settings until you come up with something that you like. Now I'm just making a copy of the lines until I reach a certain number. I'm just pressing Ctrl V just like you would paste elements on your screen. I'm just placing the last line on the most bottom part of the writing area and then selecting the rest of the lines and then um, deselect the two shapes by um, holding the shift key while clicking it and then click position and then under space evenly click vertically and tidy up. This will evenly distribute the gaps in between the lines. You just need to rearrange the lines where you need it to be. Now under elements, I'm gonna search for a teddy bear, but you can feel free to choose any element of your choice. Okay, this is the most fun part because you can get to decide where to place your elements or if you want to add more elements, you can also do so. Just make sure that it's congruent to the whole team that you're going for and that um, you are using your creativity. So just have fun with it and explore all the other elements that you can find.
Okay, here you can add any text of your choice, whether it's a part of a poem or a part of a song or your favorite motivational quotes or you can also write your name or your friend's name when you wanted to give it as a gift. So that's about it. I'm just going to duplicate this in a different color so that I can have another option. So if you like this video, please don't forget to hit the like button. And then if you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. Please subscribe to my channel. I'll be uploading more videos and tutorials in the next coming days. So please stay tuned and thanks again for watching. Bye!